Okay, so this is my very nice patient who came to see me, and he has some vision trouble, and you can see the droopy eyelid on the skin, and he's also having some trouble, as you can see here, um, the skin covering over his lids. And so this is how he looked like before he had his droopy eyelid surgery, and this is how he looks today. And so it's a dramatic improvement. Uh, let me try to in improve our lighting in here. It's a little bit dim in this room. Um, actually, you know what? I'm going to do this. Okay, now that's much better. Okay. So um, this is a dramatic change compared to this picture and this picture. And so I'm going to ask him just real quickly. He's been kind enough to say he'd talk to us. Number one, what kind of trouble were you having before the surgery? Two, what was the surgery like and how are you doing now? Go ahead. Well, before the uh, surgery, the skin was pushing my eyelids down and it was uh, affecting my vision for his open areas and with the visual vision. Right. Uh, when I had the surgery, uh, to me it was a piece of cake. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's good. Uh, it, was, it was real good. Uh, of course, anytime you have surgery, you're going to have be sore and stuff like that for right. three or four days. Right. And that's acceptable, but it wasn't that bad. Mm -hmm. uh, and Today, it's like, like the whole world just opened up to me. Great. I can see things that uh, in a wide division and further out than I couldn't see before. Great. It was really a success and I really enjoyed it. That's great, I'm so happy to hear that. So again, just showing you this picture and you can see all that skin and people don't realize that skin is a weight. You know, it's like hanging down and it pushes your eyelids down. And, and now you don't have any of that skin. And uh, your lids are nice and even. Go ahead and close your eyes for me. And your eyes close well. Uh, you have nice symmetry of the incisions. Go ahead and open. And so, yeah, I think you look marvelous, and I'm glad you're seeing so much better. What do you, what do your friends and family say? Oh, they loved it. Uh, <laughs> they agreed with what I just said, just yeah. like your whole face just opened up a lot wider. And, That's right. And just... Uh, just lifted up your whole up uh, eyelids. That's right, that's right. So if anyone asks you, and you know, they're going through this and they have the droopy eyelids and they're kind of wondering about if they have the, should have the surgery and they're worried and nervous about having it done, what would you say to them? I would tell them not to be nervous about it because yeah. uh, I didn't know anything about it. Uh, I woke up, and, uh, of course, I had the stitches in my eyes. Right. And I slept with a uh, ice pack on for a cut two or three days right after that uh, it was just things getting normal as they helped improve themselves right and as they got well that's right so yeah i would tell them if they scared about having it done don't be afraid <laughs> it's a it's a world of difference when you uh, finish up the surgery and and you know that's another thing is you know people focus on the looks, but you know, you're not a vain man. You you wanted this for your vision, yes. right? You were meaning you're not doing this for looks just for the sake of looks. You're doing this because you had trouble seeing. Just my vision was great, yeah. That's right. Yeah. And now you My looks are going to change. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, I do think it makes you look fresher and, uh, and all that kind of stuff, which is kind of a nice side effect. Well, actually it does. It, uh... I think it's improved my looks if it could be improved. Yeah, yeah, of course and, uh, it can. Yeah. yeah, it's like I said, it's just opened up my whole face where I can see things that I would usually have to struggle to do. Right, because you have to raise your brows before. Oh, yeah, I always, <laughs> anytime I read or look at anything, it's always having to raise my brows. Right. That. But not that was pulling that skin up for my eyes. That's right, right. You're trying to pull that skin out. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for sharing your story. I know that uh, there are folks around around the world who are going through the same thing as you are. And just hearing about your experience kind of helps them figure out what they're going to do next for themselves. So thank you so much for sharing. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Have it done. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Thank you again.